do a full power run at 2,000 feet. Down flaps open, full rich. And uh, compare that to an earlier flight. Same conditions. Then we're going to climb to 5,500 feet. And we're going to do a GAMI test to find out what the spread is in uh, fuel flow versus peak EGT. I'm not going to cover all the details in this video, uh, but I will put a link on there to a website where I talk about it at length to the extent of my current knowledge. Tokamichi 833 Delta Foxtrot, Wilmington Tower, good morning. Runway 32, wind 2406, clear for takeoff. One way, three, two, clear for takeoff. Three Delta Fox, thank you. Focus on the flying. The test comes second. Power's achieved. RPMs are good. Okay, I'm watching for Eagles. I'm at the 2,000 feet pressure out to 2,100 feet um, barometric altitude. I am approximately 10 miles south of uh, my house, which is one of the waypoints on this little circuit I'm doing, um, coming up on the um, Bohemian and the Sassafras uh, rivers. At any rate, um, once I pass my house and start that turn, um, rather than continuing the circuit, which I've done, this will be the second time around. I'm going to climb to 5,500. Um, I'm going to establish myself with uh, flight following with Dover. And then I'm going to go back and forth between basically Georgetown, Waterloo, and Summit Airport. So up and down the coast, basically. Um, and in doing up and down the coast, um, it'll give me a chance to do the Gammy Lean Test, which is next. Hello, Beverly. All right, here we go with the climb. Okay, Georgetown, then 12 minutes. True airspeed is 185. There's three minutes, so here we go. I'm at 9.0, I'm gonna start the pullback. That was too much. Very sensitive. There's about 8.8. .8. I'll let it sit there for 10 seconds. Could easily do that. DHT is not coming up too much. Nowhere near as discreet as we thought, Mike. There's 8.6. 8. Four is what I'm shooting for now. DHC is not going crazy. Eight point two now is where I'm shooting. EGTs are creeping up. I'm not even looking at them. Ah. My CHCs aren't going nuts. The EGTs I saw move up. Wow, you got to have your eyes in a million places. No traffic.
Got some kind of interference with number one. Okay, let's bring it back to eight even. I still see EGTs going up. DHTs are low. Seven, eight. That's all some EGTs go up. When I do this, I need to look at EGT bar as I'm making the pull as well. Having trouble getting it right on seven, eight. I'm going to worry less about getting it exactly on 7876. If I can do it again, I'll do it again. CHTs don't look to be a factor. Down to 7.5. Three eight two nine zero. Then three two nine zero. Manifold pressure has it a little. This two nine nine nine. OAT is four degrees. OAT is four degrees. Down flaps are open. Two nine nine nine. I'm running six point eight on the right side. Now I'm down to 6.5, 14.37 and 3.46. Six, Five eight, it's starting to get rough. There it goes. Three eight two nine zero squawk zero three zero seven. Squawk zero three zero. About seven. six point one, it's smooth or six, it's smooth. So I'm going to increase, smoothly increase back up to nine. EDTs are rising. So I was beyond the peak on all of them. Can't throw over eight Bravo Mike. We're done with our survey. We're going to go in. EGCs are falling. They have all fallen by 8.3. Copy the survey. Service to me. Fix me. Fix me. So I definitely did transgress the peak. How much time do I have? Uh, 14 miles from Georgetown. I'm going to start the left one. at 8.4. Let it go.
Manifold pressure isn't changing. OAT is five degrees. I'm still transferring fuel from the nacelles down to the auxes, and I'm on the aux tanks. I'm at 8.0 on the left. Seven eight, seven six. Do have traffic moving away. Seven four. Fourteen ten on the EGT's left side, three eighty on the CHT's. Not cold. I see Georgetown, so I'll turn for Waterloo and then turn north. Saw some EGTs drop. So got some room. I'm at seven. That seems to be a real big hurry uh, to get this stuff down. The CHT is not rising. So I'm taking my time. I'm not noticing when the EGTs are falling. So I'm just targeting six on the on the GPH. Once I get there, I'm sure that when I come back up, I'll verify that I went over the. Just my eyes can't be everywhere. Fourteen sixty six and three eighty. Both look like reasonable numbers. There's six three. I'm starting to hear a difference in power left to right. There's a definite difference in RPMs. Manifold pressure is good. I'm at 6.0. Just starting to feel some, some bumps that would indicate I'm not having a smooth operation. 5.7. Starting to falter. So 5.5 five and it's starting to falter. I'm going to ease it back up to 9. All the EGTs are rising. 
and now they're falling. They've all rose and fell, so I'm, I'm definitely where I need to be. Um, and I'm going to start my descent. Land at Georgetown and refuel.